This video shows you how to add a shared content security rule in ClickSense and enable shared content in the ClickSense repository. To enable shared content, create a new security rule in the ClickSense management console. Add a name and a rule description. Select the Create action in the basic section. Complete the action rule definition by selecting the user directory and the name of your authentication user group. In the Advanced section, type shared content underscore asterisk as a resource filter. The security rule is added to the ClickSense Management Console for authenticated users. You must also enable shared content in the ClickSense repository. To do this, update the ClickSense repository configuration file. By default, the repository.exe.config file can be found on your ClickSense machine at this location. Edit the configuration file and change the value of the shared content enabled key to true. Restart the ClickSense repository service using the Windows service application to enable this new configuration. Now ClickSense is configured to allow the user or user group you've selected to publish a link to shared content. And that concludes this video. Thanks for watching.